so how does the electron configuration for cadmium differ? All right, so it's just right here beside silver. So as we fill it in, we have our one S's, this one and this one. We have our two S's, that and that. Then we, this is still two, our two P's. So all of those. We have our three S's. And this is still three. And I go across and I've got all of these. And then over here, four S's. And I've got two. And then I've got all of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Don't forget that the D start at the three. But then they go back to being the fourth energy level over here. One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got all of those because I'm still not there. Still not here. 5s, 2. And then finally, this row jumps back to the 4ds. And if you count all the way over, it's 4d, 10. Sorry, I should have done them singly and then either way. So this one's configuration is, of course, I'm going to combine here to make it look like Krypton. And this is 5s2, 4d10. So if you'll compare, here we go with our silver, and then over here is our cadmium. So you can see the only real difference is this number right here. The You would have expected the difference to be in the d's, but again, because this one did that funny thing where the electron jumps up, it's not in the d's. The difference is in the 5s's.